I'm going to attempt to make a wash tub base today. It's just an experiment, so don't freak out. But we're going to drill a hole in the top. <laughs> I'm going to cut off the handles. Cut off your hand. Let's try this again. I'm going to try to cut off the handles. I'm going to cut off the handle so I can make it so that it fits on the top. And then I'm going to put a little notch in it so that it fits on the ring of the top of the tub. Installing a, a uh, eye bolt and a fender washer. I got a nut and a lock washer. You see the inside? Yep. Putting the fender washer on, and the lock washer, and the lock nut. Can you see it? I'm going to get this really, really tight. Okay, you want to drill the hole just a little bit down from the handle. Also want to make sure that the hole is not too much bigger than your rope, which this is not. I'm going to tie the rope through the hole that I just drilled. By pulling the tension on the string, you can get an idea where you put your notch up here. And you want your you want your handle to be straight up and down. I tied my knot through my eye hole here, eye bolt, and I put my string through the uh, the hole in the handle. And I'm now tying a large knot. You want the knot to be pretty large because if not, it will slip back through the hole. So tie it over itself several several times. You want a really good size knot. And once you got your knot tied on, you can take your handle and fit it back in the groove that you cut in the bottom of the handle. Pull back on the top. You have a problem with resonance and you want to get a little more sound to come out of the tub, you can take your saw and get something like a plunger or a block of wood. I suggest a plunger because it doesn't rattle because it's rubber. Put a little notch in the top of it with your saw. 
Just a little notch, enough so that you can lift your base up and put this underneath. Oh, I gotta cut a V out, hold on. get it a little tighter you can take your rope and wrap it around your handle a little bit and really get some tension on it and there you have a wash tub base